Oh, an edge, no slip. We'll get three here. Moody may even get four. The ball running very fast out of the outfield. That makes the boundary a thickest edge for Marsh. So that'll break the shackles for him. The second boundary of the innings, one to Moody, one to Marsh. That from a genuine nick outside the line of the off stump. Yes, well, De Silva has, uh, has taken the slip out, as you can see, and put in the short cover to create that bit of pressure, but he's got away with it. You'd think if he created pressure just a little further down the ground that uh, you'd still want to slip in there just for the nick. So Jeffrey Marsh won't be complaining. He'll be pretty happy with that. It's a good shot. That's a very positive stroke. Fine off drive. So for Marsh, a four and a three. They're looking for the four. Not on. Good return. It's more like it's swampy. Beautiful off drive. Look at him move into this one here. Head down through the line of the ball. Side off Stumpy picked up easily. Have a long run. Marsh driving. That could be four. That's Jeff Marsh in his best. So the like of the last two overs, conceding ten and now seven off two deliveries. Just losing his line a bit here as the Australian batsmen are on the attack. This is a beautiful cover drive from Jeffrey Marsh. Just a bit too much width here. Waited for it to come along. Plays his cover drive with quite a lot of bottom hand, Jeffrey Marsh, and it gets him in a little bit of trouble sometimes when the ball's swinging away. But that's a glorious stroke. There's the, uh, the run rate so far. Australia a bit slow for a start there in the yellow. You can see the difference there. Two wickets Sri Lanka had lost. And uh, Australia had to lose a wicket. Anna Rasuri, the left arm spinner, coming into the attack. And he does, and he goes forward for six. Good hit. Jeff Marsh picks it up, sweeping forward a square leg, wafted over the midwick position for six. Sort of, uh, it looked like he was going to sweep it uh, square, but got hold of it a bit earlier and thought, uh, well, I might as well put it over the fence. Australia away now to a good start after 13 overs. Now we're at 47. It's going to be a change. Yes, it's a glorious hit. He's just got up and underneath it. He doesn't have to hit it very far over there on that short boundary at the Adelaide Oval. Just got over the fence. That's beaten the man out, took mid on. It's pretty well timed by Jeff Marsh, but the man is coming around from long off. Three more to Marsh, puts him on to 33. Total on to 60. Jeff Marsh, 33 from 61 balls after a very slow start. That's a very good stroke. And just beating the man into the boundary. Arjuna Ranatunga is the new bowler. He's coming. Finals. 50 for Jeff Marsh. Well played in his comeback match. Excellent start. Yes, uh, certainly well played. He'd be very happy with that. I mean, he'd been dropped on the side. He would have been very disappointed when he dropped the catch in the gully. But now having made that 50 at a rate of uh, 56.2 runs per 100 balls. So that one on the full, but he's picked out the outfielder. And what a good catch. It, uh, when I say picked out the outfielder, I'm not sure he actually picked him out, but uh, it's a terrific effort. He's moved oh, a good 30, 40 metres to his left, and even then it was uh, high, and he had to leap to grab the ball. Terrific catch. You see, I think it's Don Anurasiri here. 
making ground. He catches it high over his shoulders there. Another, another foot and a half or so over his head there, and that was four runs comfortably. In fact, Jeff Marsh has struck that very well, but he's been plucked out of the air, and Australia now two.